right guys, so this next one is gonna be for your trapezius muscles. It's gonna be the dumbbell trap raises. Too often we see these, these are the, the bro muscles as I like to call them. Um, it is the trap muscle that goes right over here over the shoulder. Uh, pretty simple to work, um, but it is very common to get this wrong and involve your shoulder muscles and have things overcompensate for your traps. So you're gonna grab your two dumbbells and you're gonna to wanna to engage your core. You don't wanna be swaying back and forth. You wanna really focus on those trap muscles. And the best way to do that is when you grab your weights, don't go too heavy. If you go too light, that's understandable. You can kind of pick it up as you see fit. Uh, however, the full range of motion is the most important part. Now, when you're at the bottom, you're gonna to wanna to have your shoulders back. You don't wanna be forward or anything like that. Shoulders completely back and you're gonna raise all the way to the top, shrug those muscles in, and hold it at the top for at least two seconds. And that's gonna really provide those, uh, those muscle tears with that trap that is gonna really get that work in there. So you're, again, you're gonna stay here, core engaged. You're gonna start at the bottom, bring them all the way up and shrug. And now you see my shoulders aren't moving forward, they're back completely. And that's gonna provide that real extension for the, tra for the shrugs for the trapezius muscles where it should be. So you're gonna really wanna extend back, hold it for a second or two, and then drop them back down, and that's one rep. So very easy to work, but very easy to get those wrong. So make sure you're careful, take it slow, focus on the full range of motion. When doing dumbbell shoulder shrugs, make sure to keep your core engaged and your back stabilized. This will help so that you're not swaying back and forth and taking away from the proper form. Now, you're gonna to wanna to hold that position once you contract those traps in order to get an effective rep. This will allow the muscle fibers to tear in the correct way. Notice how my shoulders are back and not lean forward. When you hunch forward, it takes your traps and makes them not as accessible to the muscle when you contract. So make sure to expose those muscles, keep those shoulders back, and get the proper form. 